This is Handcraft Pinot Noir, 2010, uh, California. This is a new wine. Um, it's being put out by uh, Cheryl in Delicato of the Delicato family. Very uh, well-known wine producing family in California. They own a, a vineyard in the Central Coast, which is over 7,000 acres. <laughs> so they have a lot of grapes. And so they make a lot of wine. <laughs> this wine, it's labeled Pinot Noir, and it's 76% Pinot Noir. So in California, as long as you're 75% of the varietal, you can put the varietal on the label. But normally, Pinot Noirs are, they're unblended most of the time. 100% Pinot Noir. Um, but this one, and, and there's sort of a, an approach that they're taking on these wines to blend in some other varietals, including um, Italian varietals and, and heritage varietals. So this one actually has 9% Tempranillo, 6% Petit Verdot, 6% Sangiovese, and 3% Petit Syrah, <laughs> all blended into Pinot Noir. Uh, almost unheard of, but somehow it works. Um, they age it for uh, anywhere from three to six months in oak because you know they're harvesting these grapes and, and vinifying them all separately so some get longer oak age than others. Okay, so that's the story. So what you've got is a really pretty nose that's primarily Pinot Noir nose, get strawberry. I get a little bit of uh, cola. I think some nice little, um, little hints of licorice and some nice uh, little vanilla notes. Maybe some red currant in there too. Hmm. Anyway, it's kind of a pretty nose. Let's try it. very tasty on the palate. Um, very soft, kind of a little bit chewy, a lot of ripe fruit. I'm getting all that um, sort of strawberries, a little bit of vanilla, a little bit of uh, black cherry, a um, little bit of spice spinning around in there. I mean, you've got Petit Verdot, Petit Syrah, Tempranillo, all that stuff in there. Uh, it's probably all just, you know, giving it a little bit of dash of this and a, and a touch of that. But the flavors are nice and they're lingering. Um, you could match this up with uh, all kinds of nice foods. I, you know, I would have this even with you know, simple stuff like burgers or pizza, but you could probably even have it with a nice roast and it would, it would match up nicely, so enjoy.